I have some some particular interests this year. My, my biggest interest, uh, because I'm primary in the area of law enforcement, is the exploding heroin problem in Maryland and, and, and in Montgomery County in particular. I would like to find out. I'm networking with people here this morning to try to get them behind some legislation uh, that might us, help us curb what I think is this epidemic and explosion of heroin deaths across Maryland. We had five heroin suspected heroin overdose deaths in Montgomery County alone last week. We had 18 deaths last year. Uh, this is a growing problem. It's exploding all over Maryland. And I'm here today talking to everybody that will listen to me about the fact that we've got to take some action. I believe that we should model at least one step, and there are many steps we need to take, uh, which is expanding of, of treatment centers for those who have heroin addiction, etc. But I do believe that for those people who are the merchants of death selling heroin in the community, we should model uh, and, and create a new statute in Maryland that makes distributors of, of heroin resulting in death subject to life imprisonment like they do in the federal system. If you're going to sell a product that's going to kill people on the streets of Montgomery County, you should forfeit your right to live in the community, and we should do whatever we can to discourage people from selling heroin on the streets of Montgomery County. It's cheap. People are moving to it. They're moving into it in large numbers. The estimates are that we have over 14,000 regular heroin users every day here in Montgomery County. This is an epidemic that we need to step in. And I don't think many people know what's happening. And I'm here to try to waken up people and tell them, look, look around what's happening in your community. Last week we lost five. How many is it going to be next week before we begin to do something about this problem?